Third one, in this video, is how one isosceles is trapezoid. Okay, length of the DB is 8 units and this angle is 15 degrees. And then we will calculate of this isosceles trapezoid area. Okay. First step, if we draw a perpendicular line opposite of the 15 degrees, here must be 75 degrees. Right? Okay. And then we know that the base length of the right triangle, which base angles are 15 and 75, it's four times of the height. So here must be two units. Let's remind you, if we have a right triangle and the base angles are 15 and 75 degrees, ratio of base and height must be four units. Okay. So here must be two units. And then we know that in an isosceles trapezoid, these two parts must be equal. So if there's an X unit here, this length must be X unit. And if there's a Y unit here, this length must be Y unit. And we know that the area of trapezoid must be equal y plus y plus 2x over 2 times height. Therefore, 2y plus 2x over 2 times h so the area equal x plus y times h okay if we calculate this triangle area let's call here k point dbk triangle area equal half of the base and height so we can also calculate the area using this way h times x plus y over 2 right so these are again therefore 16 equals h times x plus y okay if you notice that these two expressions are equals that means the value of the isosceles trapezoid equals 16 unit square thanks for watching and if you want to watch videos like this please subscribe my channel but